Hi, I'm David Puck, and this is a time lapse of my painting of Ben de la Creme in spray paint and acrylic. And I'm going to be talking about uh, the latest episode of Jag Race. So if you haven't seen it, then uh, put the video on mute and you can just watch the painting without sound. So Bendela was basically winning everything. She won five out of six challenges and probably should have won the one that Bibi did also, in my opinion. I really loved a lot of what she was doing. My like The burlesque talent show was amazing and I loved the goth girl, the Wednesday Adam Spice girl. I thought that was hilarious. After winning again, she decided uh, to send herself home instead of sending home one of the other queens. Was definitely stressing the anti-competition, anti-conflict, like make your own rules, define your own success message, which kind of reminded me a little bit of uh, what Willem did when, but she did it in a more rebellious way. Like she chose to get disqualified. She chose to leave and showed that she didn't care about winning. She cared about other things. So it kind of feels like the same message, but in a very different way. I feel like the show kind of tried to frame it much more in like a smug way, like the Aja and Thorgy sound bites towards her. And they used a lot of Ben's interview parts that sort of said like, oh, I've won already after winning five out of six challenges. I really liked that she did it. I think that it sends like a really beautiful message, especially to younger queer people who like might not be living in the best situation and to probably definitely don't feel like winners in their life so the message of defining your own sense of winning uh and living life on your terms not on someone else's is is super powerful and i know i definitely would have appreciated that a lot when i was a child i feel like it also kind of reflects interestingly the fact that like RuPaul's Drag Race is a very particular uh, perspective and framework upon drag, but also upon life in general. It's um, a competition show, it's a reality show, so it's super uh, confrontational, aggressive, competitive, um, and it kind of prizes winning over a lot of other qualities that might be more amiable. So I feel like as well as being a good message, it can kind of uh, open up more conversations about about what drag can be. I feel like in the past it definitely had much less of a competitive and hypercritical like idea towards it. Drag race is just one perspective and it is just one part of drag as an art form and as a community even though it's a very like dominant and visible part now. And this extends into other areas also, like for example, how the show uh, understands and presents gender. RuPaul recently just had an interview in The Guardian, Guardian where he talked about uh, trans involvement in the show and, uh, and trans identities in a way that like, people are really upset about. That understanding, as well as this like, competitive capitalist understanding, really does like, permeate all aspects of the show and how it how it presents those things to people so it's really important for us as viewers to to watch it with a really critical eye and to also be open to like seeking out and learning other perspectives or at least knowing that it is a particular perspective and it is not the one yeah so that's it i i wanted to do a painting of of ben de la creme just to kind of pay homage to the message that she was trying to send and also because uh, I really liked a lot of what she was doing on the series before that. And a lot of her uh, performances outside of Drag Race also, if you go online, uh, she's got a really funny Little Mermaid performance. She's got an amazing one that's like called The Evolution of Drag, which I actually just watched today. And a little bit about the actual painting, I uh, kind of wanted to do it really poppy. I thought this like reference photo of her was just really funny like she is I may I don't know if it really translates but I made the lollipop into like an eggplant lollipop because I thought that was funny and like amped up the kind of kind of jokingly sexual nature of the, of the photo uh, yeah